Yeah. Say, how's Kale doing? Oh, oh, he's he's in this new investigative reporting gig. Oh, yeah. what? what are we doing here again? Oh, well, you know, I was thinking that maybe I'm focusing too much on taking over the world and that maybe I would have a better chance at winning my Janice's heart if I worked on my soul and my relationship with our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ. The reason I brought you here is in case we need to get a hold of you, you know, since you never want to tell us who you actually are, uh, I have decided to go the superhero route, and I present you the Pussy Signal. <laughs> oh, man, what's the names again? Could there be something... Different? I mean, I kind of like pussy signal. <laughs> so I hear you have experience in mystical pregnancies. No, Janice, something evil this way is coming. <laughs> it's an egg! So, uh, uh Dr. Darling. Uh, what are we? And you are? I am Ketonia, the low-carb hero powered by your therapeutic ketones! Whoa, 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 wait, wait, what's that? <sighs> are you saying that if you build this device? You can get my snookums back! <laughs> oh, whoa! Janice, oh, do not oh, go in The most in. high one! The one who is most high! Oh, oh, we're not worth Anyway, I saw you talking to these two small dudes. And they shot this gun that opened an interdimensional Just like my marriage. <laughs> we took those bastards down! Uh, yes, uh, well, it appears you only destroyed the vessel they possessed. Uh, they're still in your dimension. We sent Xanthor and Bill there to retrieve them. So wait, you can't get the evil beings, and Mr. Mittens Man is stuck in another dimension? Yeah, that's about the size of it. Uh, but all is lost. We just need to get our spaceship. Look, Mother, she needs me to get the mystical scarab of persuasion back after she lost it in the great Twinkie incident. Stop right there, criminal. Wish that it could be Christmas time every day? Well, guess what? Come on, it's Santa, Santa Town Santa and Cammy! Wait for Christmas to come around. Santa Town is Christmas every day. What gratitude we have for you slapping all the way out here to help us! Yeah, we're huge fans! Oi, you smell divine! Oh, hey, don't mention it! Anything to help out Janice's folks! If we don't you know what they're going to come looking for us? We need to let it know! Well, you can't get much lower than fucking Santa Town. I see two perfect specimens for possessing. Why is it stupid? Yes, you girls did a fantastic job as usual. You should feel honored that the curator asks you to guard the mystical scare. It is a great honor indeed. <laughs> you would think that you would honor us as well by letting us meet you. <laughs> mm -hmm. All in good time, my dear. Uh, two of our deer have gone masugana, and they're ripping our guests to shreds. All right. Um, you should have told 
worthy your calling. Oh, how are our plans coming along for our invasion? Oh, I'm right on the schedule, you say? Excellent! I've been programmed with Tarandophobia. Tarandophobia? What the heck is Tarandophobia? Tarandophobia is fear of reindeer. You are found guilty by this panel of punching your defense attorney. You shall serve out your turn, which is to be no more than 50 years, and no less than 50 years in Space College. Oh, see? That doesn't sound so bad. As experiment subjects. Oh, sounds like a fucking blast over here. So, tell us, Monica, what's going on there in Santa Town? Well, Lance, two of the park's deer have snapped, yes, and they're tearing the gas to shreds. Well, what about the spare fortifier? I can't find it. Stop right there! There it is. You know something? This vision board shit really works. <sighs> How are the preparations coming along with the baby? Excellent! I have suspended him in time and space. And at this very moment, sequencing his DNA is to bring forth our passage back to Earth from this hell dimension. Puritization process begins in three, two, one. Teleportation to Earth begins in three, two, one. and just be me. I am fabuloso. Okay. 
was when Mind Show released the crime play set. Whoa, Th that was like almost two years ago. We weren't even included characters yet. <laughs> yeah, they they never trusted Greg with anything anymore after that, let me tell you. <laughs> it's Genesis and Kale season one, episode 11, if you're wondering. <laughs> <laughs> Zombie Tom is still working here. <laughs> hey, what did they do with Chicken Dildo? Well, I can only imagine the way Dr. Strokinoff is always... Oh, oh, oh God, I don't want to imagine. Ew! Thanks a lot for the image. I just threw up in my mouth. Hey, uh, <laughs> this is kind of awkward, but... You seem really familiar. Have we met? Whoa, what? I was drunk, wasn't I? I, I could be really awful when I drink. Oh, man. Damn your little penis. Oh, God. Damn you, Shelby. What do you want now? Ah, I see I found the prince. Wait, what? Uh, I know, but... So, I'm assuming this means our time is... approaching. Dude, that was rotten. Oh, hey! You're here at your father's buddy wit, I see. My what-a? Let me as a devil and Lucifer know that we are ready for our final stage of the invasion. Well, I cannot allow this to happen. I told you that Shelby is one evil oh, mother. No, I don't care about this invasion thingy. I, I just can't let them use my schnookums like that. Good lord. What happened here? It was a ninja shit, that's for sure. We got our asses handed to us. Yeah. He mashed us! But the, the, the monster is... Uh, well... I gave him some Santa Town justice! And Ivan conquered his crippling tyrannophobia! This aggression shall not stand! Nice Lebowski reference. Ivan, we need to put a stop to this! I would say fuck that shit right there. He has tyrannophobia. Who the fuck programs a robot with tyrannophobia? Well, it's a good thing I went to robotic school when I was a kid. Wait, there were robots when you were a kid? So, did you hear that you were Janice's parents? Yeah. So, how come she, you know, isn't a snowman? It's a mystery! I can't believe my stupid husband invested our life savings in this freaking Santa town. I can't believe my stupid wife drove me out of this freaking vacation. Hey there, handsome. How are you? Wait, what? Are you referring to me? Maybe. Okay, yeah. <laughs> How do you do? This would be a good time to say I'm married. I'm so lonely. And you start a fire burning in me. My wife could be here any moment. So what? But do you like what you see? Lady. Are you listening? I'm wearing a ring. Me too. I'm also wearing crotchless panties. Okay, right. 
I think I should be leaving. Barky, to what he's having. Yeah, wait, what? You see, the wind is blowing and outside it's snowing. And we'll have a secret to keep. Secret, huh? The weatherman says that you're gonna be six inches deep. Six inches, huh? I've got news for you, baby. So would you be a darling and grab my jack? I don't know what to do. Oh, I have got a lovely fire burning in of my room. never happens to me. Open the champagne And I'll open your package Oh my, it's looking like my stocking Oh, it's gonna be stocked real soon See, outside the wind is blowing And outside the snow is snowing And you and I Assume a position. Oh, the weatherman says. What's the weatherman say? Oh, the weatherman says. Oh, what did the weatherman say? Oh, the weatherman says that you gotta be six inches deep. It's more like ten, actually. I think balls would have been a better choice of words. Yeah. Well, Pooh, I was hoping I would get to try out my new powers. You may get your chance yet. This has Dr. Strokinoff written all over it. The scarab. We better go check on it. Do that. Monica, you come with me. We're gonna go to the spooky goddamn mansion. What can I do? Uh, I don't know. Why did you clean this mess up? Well, I was hoping I could... Don't worry about it! Ivan is also a shop vac! <coughs> what was that? Ketones! Space. Now he's thinking, I need to poo! <laughs> <laughs> Wait, do zombies poop? Well, I want to say yes, but now that you mention it... That is probably all plugged up because all they eat is meat. Yeah, I hear that happens to people on the keto diet. But, yeah, but, but Zombie Tom is vegan. What? Uh, yeah, well... Greg needed to give Kale something to do with his useless superpower in season one. I mean, having power over vegetables seemed funny when he first came up with the idea, but in practice, what do you do with something like that? Yeah, that's a thing. Yeah, I can understand that. Yep. Yep. Well, he did accidentally create the Godzilla Twinkie, and that was crazy, man. <sighs> Twinkie Hitler? What are you wearing? Oh, this? Well, you know, Mon, I'm Rastafarian now. I thought you were all spiritual. Oh, yeah, well, you know, I kind of came to realize that all that spiritual Zen bullshit was just a way for me to justify and feeling better about smoking huge amounts of weed. Or as I like to call it now, Ganja Mon. So, you're back to kind of being a Christian again? What? 
Oh no, no. Rastafarianism is just, you know, about dreadlocks and reggae music and huge amounts of ganja mom. Oh, for crying out. Oh, oh, and, and the occasional bad guy in Steven Seagal flicks. Uh, okay, whatever. So, what are you doing here? How, how are you here? I grew up here, man. And. Secret passageway. Ah, secret passageway. That makes sense. Yep. So, I don't suppose you could uh, get us out of here? Well, maybe I could if. What? Well, maybe if you could do me the honor of going out to dinner with me this weekend. Dinner. Jaman. Sounds like a great deal to me. Yeah, easy peasy. What do you say? Oh, fine. But you have to take me to Chicken Dildo first. Oh, no problem, man. So, uh, what exactly did that dude on the toilet mean when he called me a prince? Snook out. Oh, it's you. Yes, it is I. Returning to you with a plan to save you. Save me? Oh, great. Oh, wait a minute. I've never felt so complete before. Uh -huh. You know what? I'm good here. You're good? Yep. Uh, aren't you bored to tears? I mean, you don't even have wet picks or anything. Uh, no, really. Uh, this is really therapeutic. Oh, well, if that's how you feel, I'm... I, I thought maybe you and I oh, could, Oh my god, you know. lady, look. Whatever happened between you and me, it's over. It wasn't even real. <gasps> well, it felt real to me. You literally turned me evil with an evil turning machine. Uh, potato, potato. What? You may feel differently once Shelby gets done with you. Yeah, where did you dig that freak up anyway? <gasps> How dare you talk about our son that way? What? Well, Mr. Funk, it looks like we fooled everyone by possessing these two. I know, right? They were so freaked out by that deer monster they didn't even notice. <laughs> <laughs> the interdimensional king wants us to bring Shelby the mystical scarab of persuasion. Then he shall have it. The last of the ingredients needed to open the portal and begin our invasion. <laughs> it seems my models have been penetrated by evil. Hey Rufus, yeah Nate, I uh, took Mitzi out the other night. That hot cocker spaniel down the street? Yep. Ah, uh, woo! <laughs> yeah, yeah, right. Yeah. She's really hot, man. Yeah, man. Well, what did you do? Oh, I don't know. Date stuff? Date stuff. Yeah, you know, eat some garbage, kill a couple of cats, date stuff. Well, well, but, uh, did you? Did I? Did you do the nasty? Oh, well, you know, I'm not one to usually kiss or tell. No, okay, you didn't. I, I didn't say that. Yeah, you didn't. Well, it's okay, like, fine. We didn't. Yep. Yeah. It was just so confusing. Uh, she said she wanted to, and then she did like a complete 360 on me and didn't want to. No, 180. Bitches, man. 180. What? She did a 180. If she did a 360, she would have wanted to. How uh, did you know that we could what? just sneak what? by them like that? Ninja shit, Monica. Ninja shit. There he is, Mon. As promised, Mon. Okay, you're really pushing your luck with this Mon bullshit. Are you seriously trying to repress my religion, Janice? 
Is the honeymoon over already? Honeymoon? What the? But look, Shelby has left Chicken Dildo alone. Yeah, now's our chance. Okay, but I'm not through with this discussion. Why are you always riding me, Mon? Nope, nope, wait, aboard! Shit, it's Dr. Strokenoff. I couldn't stay away any longer, my schnookums. Oh, oh. Oof. Are, are you okay, my darling? But lady, I, uh, wait, where are you taking me? Oh, you know, maybe an evil turning machine? Stop right there. Well, well, well. If it isn't the pussy whisperer, I suppose my worthless son, Twinkie Hitler, let you out. First of all, this is Janice, not the pussy whisperer. Second of all, she's kind of being a huge bitch right now, but I'm sure we'll work it out, man. I am going to kill you. Anyway, I believe you have my dildo. What makes you think I'll give him back? Oh, good. It's Shelby, dear. Would you mind dispensing of this woman once and for all? You can't treat my friend that way! Ouch! Dennis, no! Just happened. Chicken D! What's up, dude? Looks like we got ourselves a new cellmate over here. Mm -hmm. Outside the wind is blowing, and outside the snow is snowing, and you and I have a secret. To my fault? How the frick is my fault? You were supposed to be looking out for Shelby. I had to take a dump, and we were all out of toilet paper. So sue me. What does a space gun need a vegetable setting on it anyway? I told you that Shelby was an evil motherfucker. Oh.